So this is the Zanko Tiny T2 uh, mobile phone. So I think this is the second version of Zanko's Tiny mobile phone. It's apparently the world's smallest 3G phone that will become very handy if you need it in an emergency circumstance or you just want to use small phone. You had enough of all these small phones, gadgets that we've been using lately. Let's do the unboxing of this Zanko and see how tiny it is compared to my other mini phones and how useful it is and all the functions as well. So here it goes. Okay, so this is the box. As you can see, it has the sticker seal on it. So let's take it off. And the description says the it's for SOS alarm uh, notes games what sort of game maybe old games camera mp3 internal memory I guess FM radio calendar organizer video recorder BT uh, 3.0 connection 500 text messages store five 300 contacts seven days to bit sorry seven days standby uh, four hours uh, talk time one inch color screen and nano sized phone <laughs> you gotta shake it a bit to be able to take it out so here it goes moment of truth okay that's about it isn't it and um, that's the phone look at that that's even tinier than these actual mini phone that I have that's very impressive even this one <laughs> wow all right okay impressive and then inside the box we got a seal card seal and a simple USB cable that you will see is pretty standard and also this is for the sim card um, pin and the manual and etc okay and uh, let's do a bit of an ASMR like that what does it say Phone must be placed on charge to be activated. Okay. Now, if you take it out, you see that there's the phone charging and also the earphone jack. <laughs> well done. And the seal for the screen. I'll just take that out for your benefit. And um, I think that's a speaker and a camera. So that's quite impressive. SIM and a TF. So I believe that's for okay so that's where you put your sim card and also for your memory card i believe so i don't think it has internal memory maybe a very small amount but that's about it and then let's put that into this ankle so moment of truth the sim card goes it this way i think so No, okay, probably the other way then. This way? Come on. SIM card won't go in with your finger pressing really hard. You actually need the pin. It, it's, it's very weird. It's, it's basically, you just gotta... I'll show you what I mean. So you have to really press it really hard like that and then goes in but it's very difficult with your fingerprint sorry fingertip so that's all ready to go so let's do a bit of a setup shall we so it says here uh, I don't know whether you can see it says English phone book entertainment settings multimedia messaging organizer phone book so let's try the um, multi oh, come on it doesn't work okay again multi entertainment games doodle jump really crossroad stick hero racing attack football tro trophy cosmic escape jump ladder crazy bird snake game settings so let's do doodle jump shall we oh you gotta buy it i don't know forget about it then crossroad buy it stick hero buy it come on at least you gotta let me do the um snake right start the game okay good 
I see. So you can actually play Snake. You see that? So you got to buy a lot of games to be able to use it. Um, like the problem with these generally with these tiny phones is that you, when you press it, the scrolling option is really annoying. Okay. Not having good feeling about this one. I mean, the lens is tiny. Comparing to, I mean, look at that. Those are the same lens. Ah, that makes a lot of sense. All right, so let's just like, take a photo. Okay, that's the photo. So you gotta press that one to take a photo. Let's do another one. I mean, the lens is same size as this, okay. So it's a typical mini phone, isn't it? It's not as good as I thought it would be. Slightly overpriced than what I thought. Let's do a bit of a um, selfie, shall we? I don't know whether it's gonna capture me. Oh, FM player, FM radio. Okay, so on the radio side, you could go to option and you could go auto search and save yes so let's see if it's actually doing any tricks there okay oh my god if i move somewhere else it, i have to tune it again Okay, interesting. All right. So let's answer that. Hello. 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 How are you? Okay, so I could hear it quite clearly. Bit blurry, but it's actually good enough. So, um, yeah, it's working. So the good news is, compared to these mini phones that I have, um, it does work with the SIM card, so as a separate identity, these actually are used for Bluetooth answering voice system. So you can use it for emergency circumstance, but you have to make sure you always carry this pin because the end tip of it, you can really jack it in the SIM card. So there's a bit of a labor there, but what, what I'm trying to get at is that um, the phone, the, the photo quality is really bad i mean as you know the camera size is the same as this one that i have here and um, it became well if you look at the screenshot it's blurry it doesn't really focus and every time when you press the button you have to yeah it shakes a bit doesn't it so it will be blurry most of the time um the fm radio itself disconnects once you move it around as you've seen from the earlier video clip that i showed you um, and also the game, you have to buy most of the games that are, I don't think it's worth it to be honest with you. Um, the scroll up and down button, as it is a tiny mini phone, it's really annoying to up, um, do that. And lastly, the um, phone book, are you willing to manually put in, how many actually you can put in? You can put in up to 300 contacts, so you're going to spend time manually putting in those 300 contacts or somehow save it into your sim card by your old smartphone and then put it in i i think it's going to be a lot of time wasting there and um lastly i guess you can use it as a either a phone as a or a tiny mp3 player um but i think overall thinking about it is that we have gone so far ahead for this technology we i don't really think we need this technology anymore maybe about 10 years ago this will be very handy but it's an old sort of touch button press button phone and um really not good camera and um mp3 player trend has gone since steve jobs actually well established the smartphone system but i'm sorry so zanko dear zanko i have to be very critical about this but i wouldn't really recommend this product to be honest with you for me maybe i'm too much in gadgets but overall um not really 
pleased with this product at all. Anyway, I hope I give you a bit of an insight this product. So thank you very much for watching this video. This is LJP Tech. All the best. Bye-bye.